Uh, and do you uh, sometimes, um, are you able to affect like physical reality when you're out of audio? It is possible. Yes, it is possible. Not the easy thing to do. Let me, let me, this is important to, for people to understand the difference between what is possible and what is likely. So for example, I always give this example in classes. It is possible for the human body to run 100 meters under 10 seconds because Olympic athletes do it, right? The good ones, of course. Now, how likely is it that I am going to do it and or that you know other people are going to do it? Not that likely. So the fact that something is possible doesn't mean that it's easy or likely. Now, uh, doing this outside the body, trying to make an effect on the physical reality requires a lot of dense energy. And normally the, the accumulating of this dense energy that uh, many people call of ectoplasm, this type of dense energy, uh, is something that takes a lot of development, a lot of skill to do. Not impossible, again, certainly not impossible, but it just simply takes a lot of skill. So sometimes uh, we in our classes, we, we even tell people as an exercise, you know, to go to the light switch on their wall and to, to, when you're outside the body and to try to densify the tip of your finger to try to turn the light on or off, you know, especially when you have this plate, you know, on your, on your wall, right, the, the switch. So you can, you know, press the switch, try to feel it dense, press the switch, and then the lights come on. That way, when you come back to the body, there's a very clear evidence that you were successful. But also, I always joke with the students, don't spend all of your out-of-body experiences there, <laughs> poking the wall, you know, <laughs> trying to see if it's going to work, because there are more interesting things to do. So, of course, try it. Then, if it doesn't work, have five years of out-of-body experiences where you grew, you developed more. After five years, come back, try it again. If it still doesn't work, no problem. Go and do another five years of out-of-body experiences and then you come back. So it's a development process.